Hello and welcome to my video in stone and run scene builder. Those are the steps we will follow in this video. First, you need to go to the website where the scene builder can be downloaded. And here you have the one for Linux. You need to save it on your computer. I won't because I have downloaded it already. And then you just have to to click and select the software installer from Ubuntu. Then you click the button install. I won't do it because uh, I've already done it. Uh, but uh, basically, you, you will just install the sim builder. You have nothing else to do with it. So this is the scene builder from uh, when you run it from Eclipse. It can open without uh, when you run it from Umutu. Sorry, you can open it without Eclipse if you want. And now we will see how we can use it in, in Eclipse with um, our FXML files. First, we have to create a .fxml file. Basically, it's an XML file. It contains the view of the project. So as you can see, it's empty. There is nothing in it. So we will open it with Scene Builder. You just have to right click and find scene builder and this you have the man.fxml file open in scene builder from Eclipse so we will just add some uh, some pan It's just to show you quickly how it works. We won't keep it. And here you will see we closed um, Scene Builder. We saved it, and it and the content is saved in the XML. 
If you want, you can make SimBuilder the default to open all your FXML files. Usually it opens with text, text editor. When you click on text editor, it will open in uh, Eclipse. And when you open it with a scene builder, obviously, it will open with a um, scene builder. As you can see, the logo changed as well of the logo of the file. I, I like to keep the um, text editor as a default for the XML, uh, FXML files um, because, well, it, this is the Eclipse way, so and I keep SimBuilder for also, I, I prefer to work with the code really. Okay, so this is all for this video. Oh, no, think I don't think I said it by default. Okay, I did. Uh, okay, so yes, this is all for this video, and I see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye bye.